They do not want you to think too much. The U.S. Army's long endurance multi intelligence vehicle flew for the first time from Joint Base McGuire Lakehurst, New Jersey on August 7th. The air vehicle was airborne for more than 90 minutes during the initial flight. LEMV is built by Northrop Grumman with major subcontractor hybrid air vehicle. And some people did record their sightings of it. I'm Eric Shute. A video of what's believed to be the U.S. Army's latest big, and we're talking big aerospace project, hit YouTube for a Cloverfield-style reveal. This football field-sized blimp is allegedly the long-endurance multi-intelligence vehicle, which is being manufactured by Northrop Grumman for the Army. The LEMV is supposed to be a lighter-than-air cargo surveillance airship that can fly without a pilot. Wired reports this is the sort of next-generation ship the Pentagon has been trying to get off the ground for years. And according to an Army spokesman who spoke to Wired, all first flight objectives were a success. So if LEMV continues to hit its marks, it might see combat soon, which could be helpful for soldiers on the ground as well. I guess this is happening in Texas. Border Patrol tests balloons. If you happen to look up in the skies and see something unusual, don't be alarmed. It's all a test to see how a balloon can offer new technology for the Border Patrol. It resembles a blimp, but it's not your average flying balloon, and it will soon be up in the skies above the Rio Grande Valley. That's an aerostat blimp. In the town I grew up in, Sierra Vista, Arizona, they had that stationary there constantly. Ever since I was a little kid, that blimp was just always up there. And it finally crashed down last year, but I think they got it back up. But yeah, that was definitely just something you just learned to live with over there. But I'm guessing that's because it was right by the border. I don't know. Somewhat creepy, somewhat creepy. These blimps seem kind of primitive, if you ask me. I've seen stuff with my own eyes. I've seen a blimp or something with my own eyes that blended right into the sky at night after it was done flying over my head. And that was some type of far more advanced technology than these fucking ugly white balloons that they're showing us. So yeah, not so stealth right in our faces. I am of course reminded of one of my all-time favorite movies, Equilibrium. If you haven't seen it, I do recommend it. I congratulate you. At last, peace reigns in the heart of man. At last, war is but a word whose meaning fades from our understanding. At last, we are disease in the heart of man. Its symptom is hate. Its symptom is anger. Its symptom is rage. Its symptom is war. The disease is human emotion. It's actually starring Christian Bale. The Dark Knight. Batman. Now that I think about it, it's kind of creepy that these guards are dressed how they're dressed in that black armor like that, you know? It's kind of haunting in a way. thought it was a good movie. A damn good movie. So yeah, peace out. Meow. Yeah.